Hi, I'm Bob Cortez. My class, Image Management from Set to Post, which I share with Aaron at the Global Cinematography Institute. I deal with the set part of it. I teach practical examples of how you can walk up to any camera, understand what the menu settings mean, even if you've never seen it before, and select your gamma curve, your color space, how to set the ASA of the camera, how to determine the ASA of the camera if you don't know what it is, how to uh, quickly set up a monitor. We talk about LUTs, we talk about colorimetry. Well, yeah, I'm Aaron Peak. I'm a colorist, and I teach image management. What it is is for the cinematographer how to handle their images in the digital world, how to follow the images through the workflow, and how to protect their vision of the images all the way to when it's presented to the viewer. I think young filmmakers uh, are not taught the fundamentals in the same way in a uh, regular film school that someone who uh, spends two-thirds of their life on stage can teach them. My course is uh, partly theoretical and mostly practical. When the students walk out of my class, they have a pretty good understanding of what they need to do to make the camera do uh, and give them the images that they're looking for. Um, from the course, I hope cinematographers get a, a fundamental understanding of what they're recording, what the images they're recording are capable of. Um, it's not my goal to have them understand all the formulas and the mathematics and the specifics, but more just an awareness of the workflow that the image goes through so that they can protect it to what they want to see out of it. We're in more of a DIY world. The cinematographer is now responsible not only for recording the image, but for sitting in color correction, maybe color correcting themselves, or guiding the image all the way through to delivery. In the past with film or more traditional workflows, the image look was set very much so on set, but now the image is set in a combination between production and post-production. The most rewarding part is when a student looks at me and says, I've wondered about that for years and, and nobody's been able to explain it uh, in a way that I understand and now I do. That happens quite often and it's a wonderful feeling to know that mysterious concepts have been simplified and explained uh, in a way that the students get it.